Pihak pembelaan Tan Sri Muhyiddin Yassin yakin tiga tuduhan mengikut Akta Pencegahan Pegubahan Wang Haram, Pencegahan Pembiayaan Keganasan dan Hasil Aktiviti Haram 2001 AMLA dihadapi Presiden Bersatu itu akan dibatalkan. Peguam Bela Muhyiddin, Datuk Hisham Tepotek berkata ia susulan anak guam dilepas dan dibebaskan pada selasa atas empat tuduhan menggunakan kedudukannya untuk rasuah berjumlah RM232.5 juta ringgit bagi Bersatu. Beliau berkaitan demikian pada sidang media di lobi kompleks mahkamah pada selasa. Terdahulu Hakim Datuk Muhammad Jamil Husin melepas dan membebaskan Muhyiddin selepas membenarkan permohonan Muhyiddin untuk membatalkan tuduhan berkenaan. Hisham menyifatkan keputusan Hakim itu adil dan saksama kerana pertuduhan rasuah berkenaan tidak mengikut undang-undang serta cacat. As a result, as, as a result the collapse of these four main charges, we are confident that the other three under charges will not stand. All four. All four. Right? In the next few days, the legal team will meet and discuss what are the steps to be taken as far as the three other charges are concerned. With a great respect to the prosecution again, this is a case in which they misread and misapplied the law. And in the process, irreparable harm has been done to Tan Street. Number two, it's also an argument before his lordship that the charges do not disclose particulars that are necessary for the defence team to proceed with an effective defence. Again, His Lordship agreed with us. His Lordship was appreciative of the arguments and the authorities given to us by His Lordship. So in essence, we are grateful. We thank God, Alhamdulillah again, for a very fair and just decision.